How's it going everyone? Today we're taking a look at VMAX Eevee. Holy moly, I made this deck as a joke and then it just kind of beat everything. This is a super, super underrated deck that if you can hit your Cresselias works really, really well. I would recommend going second with this deck so you can enable the Cresselia, but what we're trying to do is go for G-Max Cuddles. It costs three energy, which is a lot, but it says during your opponent's next turn, if the defending Pokemon tries to attack, your opponent flips a coin if Tails, the attack doesn't happen. Now, you may think this is super busted. If you can get one of these Eevees off, you're just going to win. The problem with this Eevee is if you KO something, you know, it says defending Pokemon. So if you KO the defending Pokemon, they get to bring out something else and then they can hit you. So that can be a little bit problematic. But what's not problematic is that we're pairing it with Cresselia, one of my absolute favorite cards. A Crescent Glow, if you go second and can enable this, you can layer up a full Eevee with three energy, ready for turn two, able to evolve thanks to Evolution Incense and go for just G-Max Cuddles on turn two. It's super, super oppressive. And if you hit the nuts, as they say, you know, you can win pretty much anything because it's super, super fast. Fast. I also think additions of cards like Beta here are kind of okay. I think addition of Rose is really cool. You know, if you attach an energy uh, to a Eevee VMAX, you can discard your whole hand, get uh, two more energy. So even if they do KO your first uh, VMAX Eevee, you can lay up your second one kind of as like an all in uh, to get a second one right back. I also think cards like Zacian work really, really well in this deck. Uh, you know, if you're going first, you can use Zacian to wear up your energy. So you can hard attach once, use Roar of the Sword to attach another energy that way. Um, it's just that overall, a lot more consistent deck than I thought. I really like the Psychic Engine with like Zacian's, Cresselia's. It works if you're going first, it works if you're going second. Um, but you really, really want to try and hit those Cresselia's at the start. So hopefully you're liking all these little rogue decks. If you guys have any suggestions for decks you want to see me play, please leave those in the comments. Like, please just leave a comment on this video, no matter what it is, because those that really does help the channel. You know, we're still a growing channel. We're still a new channel. So if you could help out the channel in any possible way, that'd be absolutely wonderful. Other than that, let's hop right into these games and see if we can make VMAX Eevee work at a competitive level. Here we go. Looks like we won the coin flip today. Let's go second. Please give me a Cresselia Eevee. Please give me a Cresselia Eevee. Cresselia and a Marnie and an energy. I'll take it. I bet I can Marnie into a into an Eevee. That'd be nice. Maybe I'll just draw one. How nice would that be just to draw an Eevee? That'd be nice. Just to, just to top deck it a little bit. Oh, and they mold. We got even more shots at Eevee. Do we have the same Eevee sleeves? Is that Galar Darm? I don't even know what this card does. What do you do? That's a lot of water energy, bro. <laughs> okay. Yo, what a match. I'm gonna have to put my, uh, my dancing shoes on to avoid that thing. Yeah, but let's see how this goes. I do think that we definitely have some shots here. I wonder what they're gonna start up with. Is there a Sobble engine, probably? I can't imagine they'd mull if they have the Sobble engine. Take two. Yes, please. No, right, there's an Eevee. We got one. Oh my gosh, we did it. Yeah, there's a Sobble engine. Wow, they mold twice with a Sobble engine. Kind of nutty. Remember, guys, when you're going for a Crescent Glow, that's what we're going for here. We're going to try to load up three energy to our EVV in the back. Yeah, absolutely love to see it. They want double Sobble all the way across the sky. Now, let's do this. So, we have our Eevee here. What do we really want to discard here? I think the energy switch is probably going to be the you know, most useless card. The rest of these cards are useful for the late game. So discard that energy switch. Search my deck for the boy. All right, there we go. There we go. Do we even need to do this? They have four cards. I'm gonna save this for like next turn. I think. I, I don't. I don't just. What? What else could we do here? I guess. I'll, I guess I'll. I'll use it. This hand's not that amazing. Yeah, I don't see a reason to not do it. Yep. Oh, yes. Oh, and we got a vetted for next turn, too. That's sick. Yeah, and we even got a research. Cool. Yeah, Crescent Glow it up. One, two, three, baby. All the way to this EV, though. <laughs> We're already loaded up. Oh, man. Brave Buddies is a big attack, too. So remember, guys, during your opponent's next turn, if the defending Pokemon tries to attack, your opponent flips a coin of tails. The attack doesn't happen. Like, big EV energy. They have their Lapras in the back. Yo, we're ready right now. Let's freaking go. Who do we want to hit? How much damage do we do? 150? That's pretty weak. Um, we don't have any... There's no reason to play the Zacian, is there? Not right now. I guess it's... I, I will play it, I think. I think there's... But I am going to switch out. Let's go big Eevee. I, could, I should just kill this, right? Or should I start bosses ordering to get this thing off the board? 
Yeah, I think I should probably just start doing damage to Lapras. I think this might force like a rage quit because we are on TCGO. So they're like, oh, this is so dumb. <laughs> Yo, big Eevee out here. Turn two slapping with a G Max cuddle. Oh my gosh. Yo, it just works. Yep. He's gonna body surf probably. Oh my gosh, are we really gonna? Okay, I never see that card work. I, I'm like 0 for 10 with that thing. Okay. Yo, we take those. We do be taking those. That thing's gone. Um, I guess I can bet it if I discard the energy. They scoop, yeah. We forced the scoop. We forced the rage quit. Like, they did not want any bit of what we had. Remember, they went for their attack and they flipped tails. They tried to flip turn out. It didn't work because of the G Max cuddle. And then they just rage quit for it. So we absolutely take those EV popping off right now. It looks like we're going second and we both mill the big mill. Give me back my air balloon. I need it. <laughs> All right, what do you got? Eevee, an air balloon, and a crest. Yo, it looks like we're gonna get it. All we have to do is get our way into an energy. And it looks like old cemetery. Yo, are they playing Alakazam? I think we're gonna get it. I, I think all we need to do is get an energy and we got it. So it's pretty sick. Cool. We will be loaded up. We don't even need the air balloon. And they're mulling again. I'll draw a card, please. What is your deck? What are you playing over there? The world may never know. But it looks like our hand's pretty good. Uh, again, all, like I said, all we need to do is get an energy. Easier said than done. You know, I tend to run a little bit more energy. I think a lot of people like to run like 8 to 12. Sorry, 8 to 10. And I'm definitely the type of player that like, I like to run 12. I, I very rarely get screwed by having too much energy. And if anything, I kind of want to be able to play the game the way I want to play it. There's my energy right there. We take those. Still going to Marnie, but I will Fog Crystal away for an energy, I think. Cosmog. Okay, so it's probably playing the new Soul Galeo from Celebrations. Such a cool card. I cracked a couple in my pack opening video. That was, a, that was a fun video. Pack opening videos don't really do that good on my channel. Uh, people like to see the meme decks a lot more, but it's okay. I'm gonna dumpster this thing. Yeah, we're gonna get cemeteried. All right, so let's actually think about this. So we're gonna go Thought Crystal for the energy. Like we got it. Like this is this is pretty much gonna be it. Uh, we're gonna drop an Eevee here. Uh, I do not mind getting rid of like a Marnie to get a Zacian just in case, because I still think Zacian's gonna be really good. We already have two Eevees, we don't need three. So just run the Zacian out here, just in case we have like a dull turn. All right, and I'm trying to look for my path, just in case, because I don't want that card on there. I know path, but we do have a way to set the Eevee up uh, to evolve next turn. We also have a second air balloon if we need it, and right off the bat, one, two, three, baby. Boop, boop, boop. One Eevee loaded up, ready to go. Let's freaking pop off. My Eevee's gonna come out, man. It's gonna come out, it's gonna do a lot of damage. Let's see what you got. You're gonna evolve into Cosmo, bro? Mew, okay, it's a good card, such a good card. We made a deck with that very recently as well. It was Mew and Togekiss, and I felt they go. They went so well together. Mew's such a good replacement for the new, for, for Jirachi. Let's see, this deck looks like it's it's functioning correctly. The hard switch into the Mew, into the Evolve. Do we have Boss's Order in my hand now? Star, oh man. Yo, I was ready for you. I was ready. I had the full setup. I might, I might as, if I can't make an Eevee, I kind of want to just load up a second one with Zacian. There's a path. I mean, I could just kill that thing with my Cress. Like, I could just kill it with the Cress. <laughs> Bro, I just might. I'm thinking about it. Oh, I'm definitely thinking about it. Energy switch. I mean, I could hard switch out here. Attach here. Energy, that double energy switch and just be like Zashi and beat down right now. <laughs> oh, I totally could. I think I'm actually just going to hard attach here and just start popping off. And then when I need, when I, when I do eventually need to do something, uh, I can just energy switch the way to an Eevee. Because um, right now, Photon Laser... If I have five energy in play, um, it does 90 more damage. So we hit for the big 120. Let's go. 120 big ones. I'll take oh, they just scoop it up. You know what? I'm not going to lie. I feel like the two games that are shown with this deck are me just like dumbstring people that aren't hitting their hands. But like, you can't say that we're not hitting our hands. Like, we beat pretty much anything or be able to play at the same level with pretty much anything with this deck because we're just hitting the curve. So we take those. Let's go second. Let's go second. Give me a crest. Ooh, give me a big mill. <laughs> Oof. 
They milled as well. Yo, for some reason, like, mills are just happening at really weird times. We got the crest. We got the EV. This deck is so good. Cresselia is broken. You know, a lot of people say, like, that's a, you know, you just keep running a bunch of, like, you keep running a bunch of Cresselia decks. Like, they don't like Cresselia. I really think that, like, this card is an automatic win if you could crack it. I, I really feel that it's just too good. And I feel that when you're playing, like, card games and, you know, Pokemon, VGC, anything like that in general, like, you should play the things that you think are broken. If you have, like, enough experience and you think something's good, you should probably do those things. Um, like, right here. Like, I really... I'm I'm a big fan of all of this. Oh, my gosh. Let me do the air balloon. Uh, we don't need two Marnies. So, let's grab the Eevee. Do I want to research here? Yeah. It's a researchable hand. I, I don't mind one energy in the discard pile, too. Holy Eevee. Yeah, so we got the Eevee right there. Got another research. Got power energy. That's sick. Yeah. Let's glow. Load him up. I'm ready right now. I am super ready. But you should play the things you think are good. Um, and I think Crest is like a really, really good engine for enabling, you know, even even rogue decks like this to do well. It looks like they got what they needed. Does some big damage to the bench, but like, bro, I'm about to come out here. I'm about to be out here right now. Big research. Not bad, not bad. But like, yeah, we made like Alkazam work with it. You know, we're making this Eevee work with it right now. They have the Drizzle line. I wonder what they're going to get. I wonder if they have like hammers in this deck. We have enough energy to make it work. We can even, uh, you know, energy switch to this Eevee. Because we have a free retreat right now. But let's see. Quick ball. Okay, so they're going to go for more of a Saba line. Okay. Now the, the problem here is like 320. So we're going to have to attach the power energy. So we can actually kill the dang thing in two hits. I think we're actually still in a good spot. I think we're still in a good spot. This is kind of nice. Kind of nice. Buckets. Sounds good. Quick ball again. Discard probably a water energy so you can use, uh, you know, Melanie next turn. I need to see what they got. Probably a, probably a, another Sobble. Yeah, so they have a just full Sobble line lined up. It's not bad. Oh, that's a good draw. We take those. We take some of these. Um, I'm going to attach this power energy. Throw this energy up here. I think that as weird as it sounds, I am going to research just because I want to start getting a second EV ready. And those ordinary rods are actually really nice. So we have two energy that we can put back. I don't think we have to just yet. I, do, I like to put one EV back. Yeah, that's fine. I'll, I'll actually just do it. I'll put the energy back right now. Just because like I, this deck can get a little bit behind on energy. And so, like, I can still, like, Crescent Glow if I want to get, like, one energy at a time or use Zashian correctly. Yeah, let's go. So we should do 170 now. Puts it within range. And so even if they use, like, Fan of Waves to get rid of my energy, they're still at 150. So we're in a good spot. We are in a great spot with this G-Max EV right now. Or, sorry, V-Max EV. Let's see that coin flip. Let's see what you're working with. I bet you're going to get a Waves. Like, I mean, bet you. I bet you if I didn't have enough energy, you would have got a fan of Waves. Man, th I kind of wish that I ran um, Mysterious Food Tin in here. I just couldn't find the room. But let's see what they got. Suicune's turned off right now from the path. But let's see. Two energy. Do They can do 250 right now. Yeah, they got the Melanie right there. So they're going to use the Melanie, I'm sure. But like, if they get if they flip tails, I win the game. If I if they flip tails once, I win the game. Like they're going all in. I think they're gonna hard attach you. They're gonna try and win the game in like one turn. Cape of toughness. All right, all right. I see you back there. Oh, attach back here. Okay, they're gonna load up a second one. That's smart, I think. Tails though, we take those, yo! All right, let's see. Um, should we start? We should start getting a Zashian ready, I think, because Zashian's still like super, super good. It's better than another crest, that's for sure. I know we have a path, but like we can just start like setting a Zashian up. Like Zashian can attack with the power energy, you know? Um, anyways, uh, let's see. I don't need to do anything else. Don't really need to pop my air balloon right now. Get it, pop the air balloon. Yo, G-Max Cuddle though, we do be taking those. Let's go, 170. Give me my three prizes, baby. One, two, and an Eevee. Eh, crest. I mean, what you got back there, Chief? I got I got shots right now. Let's see if they can get the one shot. 
All right, let's see what you're rocking back there. This deck is sick. This deck is so cool, man. We have another power energy if we need it. I feel like we can load up our Zacian and just make it so even if they do kill our Eevee, we can then Raihan away to get like the last bit of energy we need to make it so Zacian can just hit for like the 150 and finish off that thing. That's kind of where I'm looking right now. We'll see. Um, you know, maybe we'll be able to get something done. At currently, it looks like they don't have... Okay, they have a research. Oh, I like that they quick ball for the Crobat just to discard it because they didn't want to draw it. That's sick. That's a good play. It's not a good player right now. Good player alert. There's the Inteleon. Quick shots. Bang, bang. So you can put two damage counters on something. You know, we could always, like, send out the Crest to buy time for, like, myself to load up a Zacian as well. But we'll see. All right, quick shots. Bro, are you going to... Okay, I'm like, you have to have an evolution incense somewhere. Like, I know you got one. There it is. All right. Well, let's see it. Can you dumpster my boy Eevee? You can evolve on the one in the back if you want. <laughs> you know, like, what is it? Yeah, he's evolving right there. Perfect, perfect. Max Lance. Yeah, Zacian's actually a really cool card. I like that it has, like, 220 HP. It's so big. Let's see it. Max Lance. Discard two, right? Yeah. So the thing about Eevee that's, like, good and bad is that it doesn't work if, like, after you kill something. Like, it doesn't stay. It says, like, that if bending Pokemon, so you knock out something, so Eevee doesn't always stay working. But I think this is still, like, okay. I'd like to get my way into an energy switch. So I can take and put the energy over here. But I think we do, like, half of this guy. They kill it. They put it in the back. Bring out a second one. And then we just boss this order. Bring it back up. Alright, because right now we have 60... We have 120 right here. And he's going to be... You know, he's going to be okay. <laughs> Let's think about this. Is it better to bring up that Inteleon? No. He's going to be able to evolve there and snipe this. And then I'll bring up my Cress. I think that's probably the best play. I don't I don't want to research away here. I think it's a way to get rid of both these bosses orders. We'll attach here, though, just in case we get Marnied. Maybe even throw this right here. Maybe I should have attached the wound to that thing. I think this is fine, though. Yo, Cuddles up. Cuddles up, 170. So he's at 150 now. So if I get one more Psychic Energy, that's how much damage you do with Zacian. So let's see what we got. If they want to try to attack us, we got the Cuddle. They probably have another Inteleon in their hand, right? Okay, they're hitting Zacian. So they know. They know what Zacian's about right now. They know that I'm laying, I'm, I'm getting that guy ready to go. But let's see what you got. Evolution incense for another Italian. Bro, you could have you could have shot my Eevee, bro. Could have shot the Eevee. Okay. And maybe maybe they know that they're Italian surprised or something. Because you could have double shot the Eevee. I'll see what they got though. What are they gonna do? They're gonna get like a boss's orders and kill the Zacian? Then I just win. But then I just win, win, win. Cause currently right now, like you don't have like you can Marnie. Not Marnie, um, like Melanie, right? You can you can get a Melanie off this. But I think we got it. I, I really do think that we're gonna be set. I don't know, we'll see. Eevee's big busted right now. There's an air balloon, bro. You're running scared for my Eevee. I see you, I see you out here running scared for my Eevee. I'd be scared too. Big huge VMAX Eevee. Bet you would bet you'd like to activate that ability, huh? Oh we win! Oh my gosh, doesn't it just feel amazing, man? Give me that. Give me this. Eevee! Cuddle these! Yo, we take those! It's not over yet. Because they didn't evolve. Yeah, it was actually it was, yeah, they did evolve. But I was like, wait, that was over, yeah. <laughs> For some reason, I thought they forgot to evolve that one. But no, they didn't. We take those. We do be taking those. Eevee big busted. Big busted.